if you have small eyes. Here's an eyeshadow that's gonna make your eyes pop. You don't have to use a specific eyeshadow per se, it really is gonna come down to technique. Now this look and technique is completely customizable, but what we're gonna focus on is keeping the top and bottom lash line shimmery. It doesn't have to be chunky glitter, but it is going to be shimmery. The shimmer creates that beautiful optical illusion and makes your eyes look big and bright. You can wear this look every single day, it's super easy, only takes a few products, so let's do it together. I've done the same exact look a few times, but honestly, it never gets old because it's something that absolutely any eye shape can do, any eye color can do, but it's really beneficial for small eyes because it opens up your eyes super, super big, super wide. It gives you a really big, bright, beautiful eye, and you can do this every single day. It only takes two cream shadows, one powder eyeshadow. You can put an eyeliner on if you want to. You don't have to, and then just throw on some mascara. Really, really easy, much easier than you think. So let's start out with Moon Dust. Like I said, you can use anything. If you wanna just use something that's really shimmery all over the lid, just do that. You can even use something like this that's extra, extra shimmery, easy. So I'm gonna take on a little flat brush like this. See this little like painty type of brush? And you know what? This is actually just a really old Sephora IT brush. I mean, back in the day, when the brushes used to look like this and it's a concealer brush a lot of my flat eyeshadow brushes are concealer brushes so yeah if you ever see a flat concealer brush definitely grab it okay i placed the shimmery shadow all over everywhere and i even went all the way underneath and you can start to see nice and shimmery really giving that optical illusion that my eye is nice and big and wide open I wanna make sure that you can see the shimmer all the way around the eye. So I'm gonna go all the way around like this. Oh yeah. Stone in, so easy. Okay, then we're going to take strobe, which is the more taupey tone. I like to just put it on the outer corner of the eye and I'm just gonna take it just like this. Again, on the same exact brush, I'm gonna press it here. Now you don't have to do anything crazy with this color. Okay, I'm gonna take it under here. Don't worry if you put too much on or anything like that. They really sheer out very, very sheer. So you can still just take your little brush like this. Like I said, don't worry, you can pull it up. You don't have to be too precise. Put it underneath like this. You can literally just throw the money. You can do that with your fingertip. Totally fine, totally fine. Just blend it out whatever way you want. And then like I said, if you feel like you need to blend it out some more. Just take your fingertip. Oh, do, do, do. Don't have to worry about it. Seriously easy. Although I always end up so shimmery everywhere. I'll find shimmer everywhere. Okay, now we're gonna take Satin Taupe. Fan favorite. Okay, just this one here. So I'm just gonna place it just here, right on top of where I put the cream shadow and strobe. Okay, but I'm only focusing it on the outer corner of my eye. That's it, because I, I still want that big, wide open eye, but I do still want some sort of definition. I want the optical illusion to pull my eye out to make it look nice and big, okay? And because Bella, she has a little something underneath her eye, so I'm just gonna take just that tiny little bit of satin taupe that's left on my brush, and I'm just gonna go underneath. It's just gonna stick to that strobe eye shadow just like that nice and easy if you feel like you did too much again just take a little brush and just go like this blend it out until you feel comfortable you don't have to have something that's super dark you don't have to have something that's super shimmery just however you enjoy it yeah i love that i love that that looks stunning let's do a little tight line like i did here i just did a little bit of tight line on the top and we'll add mascara I also love that this look is perfect for the summertime when you want to look like nice and bronzy. And then it's great for the wintertime when you can look kind of frosty as well. So you can switch up the colors. You don't have to do something like this. I actually mixed a little bit of a warmer and cooler sort of colors together, which I really like to do. But you can make it super bronzy. You can make it coppery. You can make it all cool tones. You can make it nice and silvery. Anything you want. Really, really easy. Just depends on what you want to look like. Okay. We're gonna take the Shiseido Micro Ink Liner in gray. I'm gonna go like this, and I'm just going to wiggle 
that eyeliner right in between my lashes, just like this. Now I do it a few times because I wanted the line to be a bit noticeable. I wanted my lashes to look really nice and thick. All right, so I'm gonna wiggle, 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 wiggle. Yeah. I've been tight lining a lot and some people have been saying they don't tight line and they want an alternative. So if you're not tight lining, don't worry about it. You definitely don't have to. You can either leave it blank, you can just pop on your mascara or take your same eyeliner, use a really nice little fine one. And I don't even close my eyes. I literally just go right above my eyelashes like this, right above. About halfway. I'm just kind of pressing it in, pressing it in, and you get a nice, soft, almost tight line looking line. It just gives your eyes some sort of shape, which is great. You don't have to do that either, but it's just something, another option if you want to try it. This is what the mascara looks like. Full mascara, so if you like actually having mascara on the bottom lashes, this is what it looks like. This is what it looks like just with top mascara. So you can see there's so many different ways to wear this. If you don't like wearing mascara on the bottom, you don't have to to create a really big, bright eye. The top lashes, I think, sometimes makes your eyes look even bigger. Mascara is on, brows are on. Definitely, brows just make everything. And this is it. Honestly, a very, very easy technique. You don't have to use as many steps. You can literally just wear something that is shimmery. It doesn't have to be glittery, it doesn't have to be chunky, but something that has light reflective properties in it. You see that, how it looks shiny? All over the lid and on the bottom lid as well. It's going to make your eyes look so much bigger, so much brighter, just create a, a nice optical illusion. You don't have to do the leg work. You just literally pop on the shadow and that's it. Only used three shadows, one eyeliner and one mascara, that's it. Like I said, it doesn't have to be that much. It can just be something really easy if you like. If you have small eyes and you try this look, please let me know. If you have big eyes and you love this look as well, I totally understand, I feel the exact same. I hope you enjoyed it. Yeah, thanks so much for watching. Love you.